What's up guys, we're in Universal and we're here to check out the construction for the scare zones for Halloween Horror Nights 28. We're like almost two weeks away, excited, but right now we're gonna go check out some of the scare zones and some of the construction because a lot of the scare zones are finally under construction. As far as right now, there's really no decorations, just maybe some of these lights that are probably gonna be some of the lighting for the uh, scare zone, but nothing, nothing too crazy just yet. And right here is gonna be Vamp 55. Sorry, no. Right here is gonna be Vamp 85. The only thing so far is in that window, there's some 80s theming. There's also some more 80s theming there. Uh, but nothing yet for any other kind of uh, props and anything like that. So we're here at the Killer Clown Scare Zone. And the cool thing about this scare zone is they're actually gonna be using the projections from, or the projectors from uh, the Cinematic Celebration Show to project on the walls and it's gonna be the spaceship from the movie. So you're gonna have like the tent project on the walls and every couple minutes, you're gonna see it take off and they're gonna have a new projection uh, showing for a couple minutes until the ship resets. So right now, all we really have is just these little props here. Don't know what that is. Uh, there's rumors that's gonna be kind of like giant popcorn buckets, but we'll see once they put that out. But yeah, so this is going to be a scare zone. I'm assuming it's going to also come through here and then also the streets of, uh, like, you know, right here in San Francisco, I think, if I can remember correctly. But yeah. So now we're looking at what's going to be the Chucky scare zone, and there's really not much for uh, props and decorations here. Uh, you have some of the lighting um, right down there. One of the cool things that's going to be uh, happening with this scare zone is uh, in the Facebook uh event live stream that they had a couple of days ago they said that the, all the Chuckies are going to be puppets rather than actors i don't know if all of them actually but i think some of them will be puppets uh, instead of actors which is gonna be really cool and interesting to see as well but so far nothing too crazy for here either let's go take a walk through twisted tradition this is the only scare zone so far that's actually fully well what we think for fully set up and it is very reminiscent of uh, Trick or Treat from last year, which I like. I loved the pumpkins in the trees last year. So. <laughs> I know, I can't wait. It's gonna be tons of fun. Really? That's interesting. It's good that they're coming back too. Everyone loves the clowns. Everyone does. And then, um, then there's gonna be a lot more scare, um, a lot more scares this year as well. Really? I hope that um, the clown that was in the wheelchair last year, the chainsaw clown, is amazing. Yeah, that guy scared the crap out of me last year. <laughs> So I don't know if you guys heard that while we were doing the little walkthrough, but one of the cast members gave us a little insight on the clowns uh, that everyone loves so much. They're going to be scattered around the park, from what she says, rather than just stuck in Simpsons land. Now I know it's not scare zone related, but we can't come here without talking about Academy of Villains, which we know now is going to be in the Fear Factor stage. It's going to be Academy of Villains Cyberpunk which there were some details on that live stream that they had a few days ago, uh, which I forgot, to be quite honest with you, so if you haven't seen that live stream, go check it out. It's really awesome. They have so many details on all the houses that are going to be coming to the event, as well as the scare zones, and as well as Academy of Villains, which I am very excited for, and I hope that this is going to be part of the RIP tour. That way you can get some guaranteed seating, because that's what we are going to be doing this year. And I really, really want to see this show. So hopefully it becomes part of the you know, like I said, guaranteed seating for the RIP tour this year. So that is it for us for Halloween Horror Nights and the Scare Zone updates. We are just almost at two weeks away. I think it's like 19 days, if I'm not mistaken. Horror Nights is on its way, I'm excited. Uh, unfortunately this year we can only go one time this year, but like I said, we're gonna be doing the RIP tour, which is, in my opinion, the best way to do it. Uh, so if you haven't done it, you should definitely check it out and check out our video 
on um, the RIP tour once we do end up posting that. But yeah, that's it. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, give it a like. Uh, subscribe if you enjoy the content that we post. And as always, guys, stay spooky.